Yo, man. Good so, game out there. Even though you got lucky. <laughs> man, we both left it all on the court. It's all good. Hopefully the scouts noticed. You feel me? Wow. It ain't always about this one game anyway. They know my body of work. It's pretty clear who's the better player. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, man. We're going to find out on draft day, baby. Oh, whatever. Feel me? Either way, I'm about to take that NBA by storm, kid. All right, fellas. Yo, oh, all right. I'm about to leave you with your little man. Go ahead. Do your thing. Man, him again? Looks like it's a situation ain't never going to go away. Come on, man. That dude can do all the talking he wants, man. <laughs> I feel like I let my game do the talking out there tonight. Absolutely, baby. Woo. Hey, man, look. I've been getting info right from all the scouts that were here. All right. I can tell you that they are more than pleased with your performance, man. Matter of fact, I think you finally moved past Ellis on most of their boards. What? And the media's buzzing. Let's go go a long way, baby. Yo, man, I'm just glad to get that game out of the way. You feel me? All that yeah. pressure building up to that <laughs> thing, man. I'm yeah. ready to move on to the next stage. Oh, yo, man, speaking of that, man, we got a lot to do to get ready for the draft, man. All right. So go get changed. All, all right. right. We'll talk later. Let's do it, baby. Hey, man, you did your thing, bro. Woo! <laughs> Before we get started on this pre-draft interview tour, all right, we got a few things to go over. First, the NBA sent over this personality test for you to fill out so they can get an idea of how you think, what kind of person you are. A test, man? Come on, really? <laughs> all right. All right, man, before that, though, let's talk about expectations. How you expect your NBA career to unfold? All right, we got to make sure we always on the same page when it comes to goals and expectations. Okay. All right, let's start with the where. If you had your choice to play for any NBA team, who would it be? Come on, this is, is this is this really is this really a question? Like, come on, I'm a Sixer at heart. <laughs> yeah, that's the one, baby. You know it. <laughs> yeah, man. I figured you might say that, but you know, as your agent, I can't be assuming stuff. This will help me though when I'm behind the scenes working on stuff. Okay, okay, so what is the one thing that's most important to you in your NBA career? Hmm. What do I want out of my career? It's not about the money. Eventually, I would like to make it to the Hall of Fame, but that's not the goal. Be a great teammate, that's what it's all about. But I want to win at all costs. Yeah, man, what's up? We done? Yeah, man, we're done. I lined up a few interviews with some teams that were really showing interest in you, all right. right? But before they talk to you in person, they want to get a feel of what your personality's like. So that's what that personality test is for. All right, so let's take care of that and then we can head out. Let's do it. All right. Nah, I don't think it should. You know what I'm saying? Like, the, the type of player I am, you know, if I got the ball in my hands with five seconds to go and somebody bite, why not pass it off to my teammate? You got to believe in them. Yeah, most definitely. It's definitely my responsibility, especially as the point guard. You know, usually most point guards are team captains anyway. You know, they got to run the show. It's like the QB. I would have to say defense is a high, high thing on my uh, list. Just basically because if you play great defense, great offense comes from that. You know, steals, transition offense, blocks, transition offense. You know, so you got to play defense. You got to get stops. Defense wins championships, right? Uh, I look to the coach. I'm not, I'm not one of those guys that uh, just, you know, call plays from the floor and then, you know, even when we do bad, just keep going that way. You gotta look to your coach. Your coach is seeing more on the floor than you are. You worried about one, maybe two, three players, but the coach is looking at everything. You comfortable? Yeah, of course. I'm, I'm definitely uh, ready to adapt to any role. It doesn't matter to me what happens, as long as I make it to the NBA, right? Nice to meet you. I'm president of Team Operations for the Suns. We're looking to use one of our upcoming draft picks for someone who can help our franchise take the next step. I think you might be that guy. I'd like to ask you a couple questions to make sure. Here we go. 
As a whole, the Suns have kept the same core for the better part of a decade. We found a winning formula and stuck by it, just rotating in supporting pieces where necessary. As I'm sure you've seen over the last year or so, we're in the midst of overhauling our roster. We really love the idea of you being a part of that process. What do you think about being a centerpiece for the new Phoenix Suns? All right, so the Suns. Hmm. trying to think I like being called a centerpiece I like it truthfully I do I love the idea that you consider me a centerpiece that type of confidence in me I mean how can I not love the idea I'm interested in making a name for myself in the NBA and Phoenix sounds like a great fit to me interesting next question I feel like we have our point guard of the future in Eric Bledsoe but I wouldn't be doing my job if I didn't look at all available options in the draft. How do you think you compare to Eric? Um, how, do I, how do I think I compare? I think we will help each other, mostly. I mean, I think Eric's a great player and someone I watched a lot of when he was playing for the Clippers. I think we both have skill sets that would complement each other well. And we could be one of the best backcourt combos this league has to offer, man. And that's real. Okay, I think I've heard all I needed to hear for now. You're definitely someone we can use on our team. Now we just need you to be available when it's our turn to pick. Hello, nice to meet you. I'll try to keep this brief. I'm the head scout for the Minnesota Timberwolves. We're looking to use one of our upcoming draft picks for someone who can help our franchise take the next step. I think you might be that guy. I'd like to ask you a couple questions to make sure. Here we go. Minneapolis is truly a beautiful city, but are you aware of how brutally cold the winters are? We have freezing cold, we have snow, we have it all. I've seen players walk in telling me that nothing can stop them, only to be defeated by the weather. Can you deal with these types of adverse conditions? <laughs> this is funny because we talking about weather. I feel like AI right now. We talking about practice. But this is just weather. What's the problem with weather? <sighs> it's just weather to me, ladies and gentlemen. Mm, I've been fortunate enough to spend my entire playing career in uh, more favorable weather. I can't say that I know what it's like to play when it's zero degrees outside, but I honestly don't see why it would matter. I guess it's really easy for me to sit here and say that with no experience, but man, it's just the weather. I mean, it's not basketball. All right, then. One more. So, do you feel pressure to be good right away in this league? I do feel pressure, though. Hmm. I feel pressure for myself, though. It's, a, it's an internal thing. Well, considering that I've spent my entire life working towards this goal, yeah, I feel pressure to succeed now that I'm finally going to make it to the league. It's all right, though. I mean, I've put pressure on myself at every level I've played at, and, well... Here I am. Great answers. I really think you'd fit in great with us. Here's hoping we're able to draft you with our pick. Man, you ready to talk seriously for a few minutes? Yeah, man. I figured you didn't just come over here to hang out like we used to back in the day. Yeah, not entirely, man. I mean, hey, I'll teach you a little lesson in some NBA 2K later. <laughs> you know, again. <laughs> Whatever, young. Yeah, we definitely gonna have to get a game in, but hey, let's get that business out of the way first, all right? All right, man, look, I know that you've been asked to do a lot to get ready for this draft. Heck yeah. I mean, besides the showcase, you got workouts and camps and interviews, and you handling it all like a champ, man. It's just one last piece we gotta sort out. What? Ah, come on. What is it, another private workout or something? With the Cavs? Nah, 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 Wizards? nah, nah, nah. We, we done with workouts, Rockets, man. It's maybe? nothing like that. Hey, look. 
we got to get you a suit. <laughs> a suit? Yeah. All right. I can live with that, man. Good. Do it. Good. Because you know how this draft is, man. I mean, everybody's going to be watching you, so you got to make a splash. Uh, you seen how players in the past went all out. Yeah. Man. Noah. Yo, Harden. Oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Yo. Yeah. Man, no one's forgetting that anytime soon. But hey, I can handle it. You know I look fly in whatever I wear, baby. Mm-hmm. Uh, that's up for debate. I got two words for you. Junior prom. What? Yo, I was styling back then, dog. Uh, yeah, right. Styling. <laughs> Come on, son. Oh, my Yo, God. Yo, I feel you, though. So what's up? What we got to do? Hey, man, look, don't even worry about it. I'm going to front you some cash so you can get something that works. All right. But if you can, you should consider kicking in a little extra just to make sure you really stand out. But that's on you, though. All right, I'm going to think about that. But hey, let's really get down to business. All right. NBA 2K, baby. Oh, come on now. Yeah, I'm going to whoop you, son. Uh, Yeah, right. That'll be the first. <laughs> Don't be cheating, neither. Year, this is Siri. Thank you for watching and be sure to like this video. For more videos from this particular mode click more videos. If you want to see more content from IKC click subscribe. Oh and don't forget to follow IKC on Twitter and to like his Facebook page. This is Siri signing out. Peace.